not just spamming the request to speak right. button because that just like yeah, it's just annoying to all of us. All right, yeah. so I started the stream now. All right, so okay. welcome to a uh, stream. I haven't live streamed in like forever, so this is the first live stream I've done in like a year. Yeah, the last time you did it, I think you crashed the train while you were live streaming. Anyways, <laughs> welcome to tonight's podcast, Friday Night Podcast. It is a podcast where we talk about random talk topics from 8, 8 p.m. to 9.30. So we got an hour and a half to talk. Tonight's topic, toxic people and how to find them. There are a lot of toxic people out there. For example, there could be a toxic person in the audience right now. <laughs> Anyways, toxic people are like Karens, but they're but you can find them online. <coughs> so we meet, yeah, I'm pretty sure one time I was playing like Subware Whales on Roblox. Uh-huh. And suddenly this random toxic guy just comes out and saying, Oh, get out of my train. Yep, I've had that happen before, multiple times before on multiple other games. <laughs> and yeah. it's always a pain to deal with. Oh yeah, Oops. yeah. So, so how to identify them? They they speak to you in all caps. They have many spelling mistakes, and they are and they are just telling you to not do something. You reply, okay, okay, I'm sorry. It's like blah, 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 blah. that's a talk. That's how to identify one. How to find them? That just came up in my mind. That's just a joke. I can't. I mean, really, you you can like find toxic people just out in the wild. Yeah, you can just... any random game, <laughs> yeah, and how at to some find point, a... you're gonna find a toxic person in that game at some point. You know, like, yeah. the easiest it's way to inevitable. find them is go join a really popular yeah. game. Yeah. Um, Adopt Me, Adopt Me is... Full of toxic people. Like a full, lot of, of people. full of toxic people, and also breaks Roblox every single time it updates. And don't even yeah. get me started, don't even get me started on Meep City. Oh hey! Oh hell no! We'll talk about we'll talk about <laughs> Beep City next week. We'll talk, yeah. we'll talk, we'll talk about Beep City next, yeah, next week. Oh, by the way, by the way, just as a heads up for the people who are actually listening, uh, listening in the studio on here on Discord and also wherever Pack is actually streaming, I do have just a tiny little bit of a adult of a potty mouth. So if I Swear that's just kind of me. That's just what I do. Yeah, that's okay. Um, yeah, fair enough. Surprisingly, <coughs> at my school, there isn't a lot of toxic people. Like, my district actually has, like, a lot of security guards because of the recent sh shootings, you know? And yeah. all the people are usually outside, so there's really actually a lot of nice people at my schools. Mm -hmm. Um, elementary okay. school, like, really sucked. There are so many big toxic people there. Uh, yeah, that's... Like, friends to go kill themselves, which you is really the worst not the worst toxic cool. person you've ever dealt with. <laughs> um... Uh, uh, Quincy a... asks in No Mike if he can speak. He needs to mention the uh, worst toxic person uh, he actually, ever dealt yeah, with. Yeah, Want me to yeah, let him in? Sure. We're gonna let people up now to, uh, explain their story about toxic people, so here okay. you go. Alright, yep, Quinn, you're up. Uh, uh-oh. Why is... Why the hell... Something... Um, okay, there we go. He just wasn't raising his hand up. Uh, Alright. Okay, fair enough. You're in. You're in, Quincy. What's your story? So, I was <coughs> playing this game, I don't remember what it was, but then, one of my friends was a toxic person, but then, I stepped up and I dealt with the toxic person. He was really rude saying um bad stuff or racist and stuff like that, even though we're not racist. And then a day later I got the answer oh. Yeah. Yeah. It was probably like a major popular game that was so easy to forget. Like a lot of people forget their favorite Roblox games. Like remember like I forgot about that favorite game I played all the time, where it was like mm -hmm. it had like trains, and then you could, and it was like very high quality. Not yeah. Like I forget what that game was called. Mm -hmm. Of uh, forgetting, does that? Did anyone forget what Grand, what mm -hmm. Grand something Railway? Remember that GCA? Grand Continental Grand Continental Railway or something? No, uh, not the no. British, but the American game. No. I forget what it's called. Um, uh, it seems like Zerg wants to speak. Can I? Can I uh, let him into the? 
Grand River. Sorry, <laughs> Grand... Was it Grand River? Um, was it Grand River Scenic? Yeah, Grand River Scenic. I got banned. I got banned for that because <clears throat> before, I got banned by Gulick because he hated me. Oh, that's and just they, admin. That's just admin abuse, yeah, he, isn't it? Yeah, mm -hmm. and he refused. And they refused. Did you? Five 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 also refuses to ban me. So, Zerg, you're up. <clears throat> All right, what's your story? I mean, not much. I went this game real quick. Uh, Jack yeah. right. already knows the story because I told him already. So there's this toxic kid at my school named Noah. He's in the grade below me. We're playing dodgeball. Uh, he was trying to hit me to get me out because I kept trash talking him. I wasn't being toxic first. He kept calling me loser and stuff. Uh. What happened was my friend catches the ball to get him out. He charges at me trying to <laughs> fight me. And I'm like, dude, why are you being toxic for no reason? I'm legit just playing the game how you're supposed to. Then he tries swinging the punch at one of my friends and actually successfully landing the punch. Oh. I can tell you, I start yelling my lungs out, saying, Back the fuck away. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, just a, quick reminder, you're, just a quick reminder, you're up only for once and until next Friday. It's only yeah, one well, person we want yeah. to... We want to make it. Can I say one thing? Can uh, I say one thing? Mm -hmm. Sorry, Quincy. We have to answer you next week. Can I right. have to answer next uh, week, then? All right. Uh, Does somebody raising their hand up? So I guess we're just going to talk about our story so far until <laughs> somebody at least raises their hand up. Yeah, I mean, um, I mean, I, I mean, I think the only one who can raise their hand right right now is um, Kai. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, red ex red sponge, right. can you like not uh spam the You're not uh, spam that please, thank you very much. Um do you guys uh do you could you guys mind if I um if I I can stream in here, can I? No I can't. Oh uh, no I can't. I don't um it was I don't know why you can't stream here, but yeah. Anyways, I have a bunch of stories of interfering with toxic people. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I have a bunch of yeah. Pat I have a few stories from story. dealing with a toxic person. Pat should remember this story easily. It's not really a toxic person, but half toxic, half hacker. Remember when he hacked A&W and gave everyone free admin? Yeah, I remember he kept on. Every time we tried to ban him, it wouldn't go through. And text, he kept some messaging in the chat box saying yeah. that wasn't very cash money yeah. of you. He was like very like I don't know what I don't know what type of exploit he was using, but yeah. He was like he's not he wasn't an exploiter, <clears throat> he was a full on hacker. Like a full on hacker. Yeah. Like I'm not even yeah, like literally. Luckily, a day later I tracked down his username and I have a picture of it. He was on he was on the most wanted list in Railbun, I think. I don't remember if I put it up yet or not, but yeah. yeah. Also, for the people who are on Railbun, applications are until tomorrow night. I, I, I was so busy, you know. So anyways, um, <coughs> so um, one of my other stories, I think, I don't remember this. Oh, yeah. I'm pretty sure Pac should remember this story, too. We, I were, we were playing Somewhere Whales in a friend's VIP server, me and Pac. We were just... At, we were at the new um, logging area location, which we had to actually drive to, and it took a very long time because the line's like 40 minutes to get through all the way. So, and then suddenly, Jade, the friend, and a person named Beox, remember Beox, Pat? Yeah, Nathan. Yeah, Nathan, he just comes in and tells us to leave, and then yeah. he threatens <clears throat> into the friend to, and otherwise... And uh, sadly, our screenshots I think were deleted. Yeah, but they're... Nathan threatened us, us, and then they unfriended me, and then we never spoke again until a little bit, and then threatened again, and then just left. Yeah, the friend I, was. I, that, uh... That's why I left the top of the train faces community because one, it's just extremely toxic. Two, I just hate <clears throat> dealing with the drama there. Like blue train with <laughs> like literally, there's this pedophile that you know the guy who made cbr3 he's like a sex offender 
Speedy Skips. Yeah, he's like a sex offender. Oh, so is he like is he a registered sex offender? I think so. I well, don't... that's not that's not good for him. Yeah, and now P mm. and now I think it dropped ever since that he um ever since the the blue train with friend server announced this. I have a picture of it. I'll send it into No Mike's chat. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think I have it. <clears throat> oh, it looks like my, um... Hold on, I have to restart Discord. Be right. 10 four. Okay. Oop. He should be able to just chuck himself in here. Yep, yep, there he is. All right. All right yeah, there. sorry about that. Um... That's uh, fine. Pack, do you have any stories... Of toxicness. I don't. I have any more. At least I do, but I don't remember. Mhm. Mm I don't think I have that many stories. He's um. <laughs> oh one, um. Yeah. Big one. How about you? Um. The only thing that I could. The only toxic person that I can think of, off the top of my, <laughs> the top of my very very tall conning tower. Is hold on, bear back. My grandma's Carol. calling me. I'll, I'm gonna take this call real quick. Okay, yeah. Uh, okay. Is well, he's still streaming, luckily. Yeah. Is probably Carol. Remember that? Remember that guy? Oh yeah, Carol, the guy who leaked Train Master's track. Or yeah, something. yeah, the guy who leaked Train Master's track. He. Oh, wait, basically, wait, 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 wait. We he have basically Amber thinks the Southern Railway is the only railway in the United States that actually deserves to be, deserves to live. Um, hold on. For those of you who are a part of the overseas A's, um railroads division, um, like I I don't remember, but I think Kai and Postal are like from overseas members. Oh yeah, so, fair enough. So quick heads up, um. Their train master is a person who makes American Eastern Division train game, Eastern Division train games, which Wait, is like stock. or Pennsylvania, which I live like an hour and a half away from. SEPTA, mm -hmm. Southeastern Pennsylvania Transportation Authority, which I use there almost every day. Um, so like that part of Pennsylvania, um, Pen part of the United the, States. the Pennsylvania, the, the famous roads. The famous Eastern Roads, um, the Pennsylvania yeah. Railway, r r Railway, yeah. Railroad. Our, our overseas members don't really know that, so if there are people who are listening and are overseas, that's okay. just what what railroads we're talking about. Yeah. So yeah, continue. Yeah. yeah. And um, here's the thing: I had him set up for this is going to this is probably going to confuse pretty much every single one of you overseas guys overseas guys but pack and apple would know ex theo would know exactly who i'm talking about uh I don't know, know what i'm talking about Wait, but uh, i had it? him under contract under written contract oh yeah yeah that one yeah 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 no, yeah. no like no you know under not under a written contract that I sadly do not have a screenshot of, Sam. I wish I'd gotten a screenshot of that. Under written contract for him to construct me. Yeah, a yeah. brand new New York Central, unstreamlined, because he doesn't want to do the streamlining, which I get. Because, I, because that's, that's, that's even more of a pain for him. An unstreamlined J3A Hudson. Ah, uh, yeah, those things with the centipede With the centipede tender on it. Oh, oh yeah, I remember your... Huds and I think that got um stolen by Carol. I can't remember. I think it he did. never built. He never built it. <clears throat> oh, oh, I'm, no, it, no, the other guy didn't he steal it? No. Um, I, somebody stole get this. it. Well, I like, get this. I get this. You know what happened? What's up? What happened? He was, he was ninety five percent done with it. Oh, jeez. Now, what was the rest of the five percent? Um, all he had to do was install the GUI, and then he's done with the thing. Ah, uh, so you had to painfully install it yourself? No. No, so you know what he, know what he did? You know, you know what he did? What did he do? Put a virus He, in? um, he delivered it. He delivered it in the state it was in, the uh, non-GUI, GUI one. Oh, he, wow. Yeah. So I didn't have a GUI for it. I don't have a store. I have a GUI for it. 
for it. But then again, here's the thing. That same night, because I had been a freaking idiot and not saved it to my files, he went into my studio and, and deleted it. Yeah. And scrapped the model right there. I actually joined the studio while he was mid scrapping of the engine. Yeah, I, I remember that one. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, like, yeah, and here's the thing. I was so damn mad. Yeah, you fired him on the spot, I think, that day, right? Fired him on the spot, right there. Yeah. See, people can be a dick. Like a total asshole. <laughs> no, but also, yeah, but also, he's just a, he was just a toxic person. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. I mean, you know how many Robux I had to pay him to even, for him to build that? Uh, I think you said like 150, 120? 100, 145 Robux from the construct that. Mm, I was close. And here's the thing. He turned around, he turned around to one of his friends. Know what he did? Know what he did? What did he do? Like, he told. construct, he, he constructed <laughs> a brand new Southern Railway, Railway Pacific for free. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, that's just yeah. straight up. Why well, he's just using you for money. Yeah. <clears throat> that's just messed no, up. No, but here's the thing. Here's the thing. The only reason he actually said this to me, he said the only reason I'm paying he reason I'm asking for payment is because it's not it's because it's New York Central and not Southern. That is the stupidest reason I've heard of to not to get someone to pay. Like that's <laughs> That's just stupid. Yeah. But here's the thing, the New York Central doesn't exist. It um, hasn't. It hasn't yeah, it's existed. A fallen flag. Yeah, it hasn't existed since Penn Central was a thing. Penn Central, I thought. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, Penn Central. Yeah, yeah Penn Central was what happened when, <clears throat> when the New York Central and the Pennsylvania uh, had a baby and it failed. Yeah. Penn yeah. Central was just yeah, and the, the the freight part of it went the. But with the Conrail, they derail like eight thousand times a week. That's what Penn Central does. Yeah, but here's the thing: CSX has not a bunch, 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 CSX has not much better of a track record. <laughs> I'm holding a metal brass cannon in my hat, hands. Oh, oh, nice. Um, but yeah, but here's the thing. <laughs> um, the, the well, the Southern doesn't exist exist either because Norfolk Southern is a thing. Yeah, yeah, what about it? Um, he still <laughs> considers, considers the southern part of Norfolk Southern to be an, be an independent railway from, the, from Norfolk Southern. What? He's delirious to the fact that Norfolk Southern, that the southern railway doesn't exist anymore. Norfolk Southern, that Norfolk Southern was, is the successor. Mm. He still thinks the southern railway exists. You want to know why? Why? For Southern Railway 4501, Southern Railway 630, 754, and 1401 all still exist. So he run for tourist lines. How stupid is he? No, but here's the thing. There is exactly two, two remnants of the New York set of any, any class of New York Central steam, right? Oh. Yeah. Neither of which have ever operated in preservation. Because they're in museums. One is in the Museum of Transportation in St. Louis. And the other, one's in, the other one is the National New York Central Museum. Neither of which have actually reigned in preservation. Uh. <laughs> they're completely unrestored. They're not even cosmetically restored. Oh, wow. And yet... The New York Central is more famous than the Southern Railway in steam preservation. Oh wow, that's just straight up toxic and rude. Yeah, that's just straight up stupid in the first place. No, no, when, no, when I say it's steam preservation, I what I meant to say was it's more famous than the Southern Railway. Period. Oh wow, the New York Central invented the Hudson type steam locomotive. Oh wow! What did what did the Southern Railway invent that revolutionized railroading? 
Uh, nothing, I don't think. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. What what did okay okay what did the Pennsylvania Railway let's just switch topics what did the Pennsylvania Railway do to revolutionize railroading in the Northeast? Um. Well, once they had actual they built new like streamlined locomotives like the T one and the um and they also used a lot of diesels <laughs> like the F unit. They they, they, uh, they electrified the they electrified the Northeast corridor. Yeah. And yeah, and introduced the revolutionary GG ones, yeah. which lasted for forty, which lasted for over forty years in regular revenue service. Which really isn't a lot compared to um, compared to what was I gonna say? Never mind. The only get this: the only reason the GG ones got replaced is because they couldn't re- because apparently they couldn't retrofit it with electric train electric train. Heating, lighting, and heating, maybe because of the 1930s era t- era electrics. Which fair point. If you can't retrofit it, you could have to replace it. Mm. And they replaced it with the toasters. Speaking of, speaking of the toast, speaking of toasters. Now speaking, yeah, speaking of the AEM sevens. <laughs> Uh, Union Pacific used, uh, this is completely random, but Union Pacific used steam, Southern Pacific used steam, but what about Norfolk Southern, did they ever use steam? Or what? No. Norfolk no. Southern had, Norfolk Southern did have a steam program, you know, you know, you know which locomotive was not Southern in their entire steam program? Don't fucking question 611. I knew it, bro. <laughs> Don't fucking question. Right Six Eleven is the only, is the only, is the only locomotive in the Norfolk Southern Steam Program of five locomotives that is not Southern. Yeah. Wait, what about uh, twelve eighteen? Twelve eighteen, twelve eighteen never ran in the actual Steam Program itself. Oh. No, but Six Eleven did because of its visit in Irondale. Mm-hmm. Yeah, twelve eighteen ran through my I area too. I watched the documentary about that. Back when 611 was still getting refurbished after she was found, she was mm-hmm. sent to Irondale and she was put in the Norfolk Southern on Steam program and she just ran there until she went back to Virginia. Yeah. And the, uh, yeah, and then as of right now, she's still straight in Strasbourg. Yeah. Honestly, I wish. Honestly. No, you, you, want, you want to know why she's stuck in Strasbourg? We talk about how. Well, we're getting off topic here about toxic people, so let's get back on that. Yeah. Uh, uh, well, let's hang on. Let's let, let's let, let's change from toxic people to toxic companies real quick, since it's still relevant. It's still relevant. It's tangentially relevant, but Amtrak is one of the most yeah. toxic companies, at least as far as oh, God, to steam as you can get. There are so many derailments on Amtrak. I can't count them all. Yeah. No, but here's the thing. You want to know why Six Eleven is still at fucking Strasburg? Why? Amtrak? It's because it's because Amtrak won't authorize the movement. Oh. CSX and both CSX and Norfolk Southern Hello, three years, have authorized Six Eleven to be Southern. moved back to Roanoke. Oh wow! But since Amtrak owns the track, owns the track that the Strasbourg connects to. They can't move her. Mm. Because because Amtrak will not let 611 cross over onto their main lines. Mm. So she's stuck there. Oh. I, thought she was back- no. I thought she was back in Virginia. No. I watched the I watched the virtual rail fan camera in Strasbourg Berg, yesterday. They have the okay. shed doors open. On the platform end, there was six levens. I'm going to. I'm, I, 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 I'm not, I can't even avoid being overly adult here. Really adult, adult here. That's just my nature. But you can see the tip of the dildo of her streamlining sticking out of the shop. Sticking out of the shop. Sorry for the um bad wording here, but we call six eleven the dildo engine. <laughs> the rolling. Yeah. She looks like a rolling dildo. <laughs> 
Because he is. I'm a NSO, uh, CSX or NSO said, excuse me? Yeah. Who said yeah. excuse me? NSO. Oh. What about 21st Century Steam with 630? Um. Yeah, yeah it ran through my area. Yeah. That hasn't been a thing for a while. Because there's no 21st century Steam programming anymore that got cut in what 2005, I think. No, that cut, got cut in like 2014, I believe. 2014, correction. But yeah, nowadays, if you see go to TVRM, if you take like the Somerville train, yeah, you have, you have to get clearance through Norfolk Southern to go, yeah. Norfolk Southern for it. And a sub said, what's happening to Amtrak? What's happening to Amtrak? Um, Amtrak has a dodgy reputation as far as trains coming off the rails. No, actually. Right, what do you Matt. mean by that? Uh, Metal, what do you mean by that? Because, um, the land block production said said that they had to get clearance through the Fox Southern for the Somerville trains. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm open to be corrected if I am actually wrong, but that's just with the data that I know. E balls. I'm back. E balls. So, so why did he distinctly mention Norfolk Southern? I went to. Wait, who mentioned Norfolk Southern? The land block productions on the Somerville train on TVRM Somerville trains. I don't know. Anyways, um, so yeah. Anyways, more about toxic people. Maybe, yeah, like, like maybe, maybe they have to go. Maybe. They have to go through a Norfolk Southern dispatcher, dispatcher to cross the Norfolk Southern trackage there to yeah, get yeah. to the CNC, which would make complete sense. Yeah. Oh, by the way, we, it is one minute at one minute until. Uh, by the way, it is time for tonight's. Uh, it's hour until the um, show mm -hmm. ends, where basically every eight thirty we talk about something for one minute. Until it's 8.31, but right now it's 8.31 because we I forgot to um, mention it, so it's going to end at 8.32. So, we talk about the exact topic, topic, and, like, we have to explain, like, what's happening, what it is. So, right. let's uh, start. Wait, hold on. Three, 3DS, 3DS said his friend told him a rumor that Union Pacific was going to merge with BNSF, Canadian Pacific, and Alaska Railroad. Yeah, I still the Alaska Railroad. Why? 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 Oh, by oh, by, oh, by the way, on that topic, <laughs> on, on that on that topic, forty four forty nine is a is a Union Pacific Heritage Unit since it's so painted in Southern Pacific, Pacific Daylight. But here's the thing: it's the here's the thing: it's a dual heritage unit. It's owned. It's technically, if you want to be kind of owned by Union Pacific, but it, but it's a, but it's a BNSF heritage unit. Ding, ding, ding! Hour until over is over. Hour until over. Time to talk about, time to talk about random shift, random shift for one minute each. Uh, actually, we did that already. Actually, we just finished that. Um, oh, fair enough. yeah. So toxic people. So it, so mm -hmm. let's go wait, back to on. toxic people since we're already halfway there. Yeah. Hmm. Technically, it's only been a half hour, but and still kind of this like, um this like this this like, podcast like, went from us talking about toxic people to us just talking about railroading American mostly American railroading yeah. in general, and then uh, back to back to being toxic people. Okay, yeah. cool. This is gonna be all over the place. <laughs> Anyways, like um, yeah, let's get back 
fun toxic uh. people like <laughs> East everyone all right so anybody got any stories or something like uh let me check the live stream for pax <laughs> video and see if anybody's actually watching Meanwhile, yeah. you just keep talking about toxic people and all that. The Andre, <laughs> the rail fan of production, says... Uh, oh, yeah, let's talk about the rail fanning wait, hold on. team. Uh, they yeah. want to know... I think they want to know if they can come into the podcast. Who? Who? Uh, a couple people in my stream. If you could... Uh... I'll, I'll show them the invite link, and then they can join. If they yeah. listen. Yeah, I, listen, I, and listen a little bit more directly. <laughs> oh, by the way, for the guys that are watching um, uh, Pac's stream, I have no idea if I'm even coming through clearly not clearly for you guys. The mic quality is kind of a bit shit. Well, I, I, I actually <laughs> understand you're pretty fine. Okay, cool. <laughs> I, I can hear my the stream on my phone right now. That's so funny. Yeah. <clears throat> anyways, um. Anyways, I'm watching the um stream and yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyways, to got to um. Let's see if I can like make up a. Um. Let's see. Oh yeah, toxic people like count as Karens, in this yeah. scenario. So, does anybody have any encountering with a Karen streams besides me? Because um, I, I haven't. I've encountered, encountered at least one Karen oh, hello. before. Hello there. And uh, she and um, hello. she ended up being uh, she's kind of a bit <clears throat> dead. Oh. Uh. And anyways, can could you? Yeah, she's dead. She. Basically killed herself. Oh. Um, why? What was her story? What's her uh, story? Base, basically, because I was I was working a uh, train on the Kubernetes at Toltec, and it, we were at our lunch stop, stop and this uh, this Karen Karen came up to the cab while I'm in there eating, eating after like after doing something so incredibly fucking stupid. Fucking stupid. What did they do? Um, I had already blown the five minute, made it basically five, you got five minutes, get your ass back on the train. Train before you leave you. Warning. And I was just about, about to reach up to the whistle and grab the whistle to, to sound off that we were about to leave. When all of a sudden, I see, I see this carrot walk around my side of the engine. Oh. And then what'd she do next? And she basically walked up to the cab and said, Hey, Kay, can I get a ride up here? I was like... I leaned down and Lula had to yell over the side of the engine. I said, No. Yeah, can't, can't have rides. No rides. He's like, Oh, come on. Is there no rides because of the pandemic? There's no there's no rides because it's not safe. Oh, yeah. There's way, there's way too many ways in the cab of a steam engine to hurt yourself. Yeah. Also, quick... So we don't, so we don't have... Rides in the cab, unless if there's three people in the cab, at all times. Bro, does she not know that sometimes during steam incursions there has to be sometimes three crew, and that uh, mm -hmm. sometimes three yeah. people crew just yeah, yeah because yeah. of the safety hazard and they have to mm -hmm. watch over them because of how old the engine is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And the reason I, if if the conductor had been in the cab, or if one of the other conductors who was riding passenger that day had been in the cab with us. I probably would have let her up. Her up. Mm. But, no. No. He wasn't up there. It was just me and my fireman. So it wasn't safe. So I said, no. If, there, no, if, there's three, if there had been three crew members up here, I probably would have let you up. But no, I can't. There's only two of us up here. So she, so she gets on the train. We leave. We get to Rock Tunnel. And, and I'm barely moving as we're going through Rock Tunnel. The, um, the fireman has the firebox doors open. So we can actually see what the heck we're doing. All of a sudden, I hear a voice behind me. 
and and it's that Karen. It's the Karen. Yeah, she had, yeah she had done something so stupidly dangerous, dangerous that it's illegal. Like it's a federal crime to do what I'm to do is. Oh wow! When did the, she kill? The uh, the head ain't the 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 break the brakeman that was riding passenger was in the doghouse. Was it the doghouse on the back of the tender? You had a doghouse on that train. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, all, 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 yeah, all of the Rio Grande Mikados have dog houses on the back of their tenders. Well, I like dog houses. Oh yeah, that's probably because of the um rocks that tumble down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Plus, plus the engines, the engines designs date back to before air brakes were a thing, were a thing. So yeah, it yeah, it's just it's a convenient place for like a head and a brake bender ride without being in the engine. Oh yeah, sorry to interrupt, but a quick note mm-hmm. for all the yeah. staff who work for the podcast and crew. Mm-hmm. Um, try we we might bring up some stories about the 2020 incident, and we want to use words that avoid like what happened because of YouTube stupid moderating. So try to use words like um, pandemic or incident or mm-hmm. mass reason. Or- Unforeseen. Uh, uh- Unforeseen consequences. Yeah. Hold on. Be right back. Ten four. I'll I'll I'll, I'll, I'll pause my um pause my story until he gets back. Uh, pack question. Uh, can you send me a link to your stream, please? Um, I'm pretty sure he sent it, like, in the, I'm pretty sure, no, no, I'm just thinking of something else. Okay. Yeah, but, um, anyways, so what happened was the, um, the, the break, the brakeman that was in the doghouse, I saw this, saw this person climb up the back of the tender. I'm back. In pitch in black. Fact, I heard the stream in- come through your mic. Anyways, yeah. if anybody's wondering, next week's um, topic. next week's uh, topic is the the railroads dro- the railroads on the incident, where it talks about the entire the the jail side and the Oni side, where it talks about how the raids were happening. That's next week's topic. Stay yeah, tuned okay. in. Yeah, and, and um, what hap- what happened was the. Uh, she um she had crawled up the she had climbed up the ladder on the back of the tender, of the tender. Passed, managed to sneak past the lit doghouse because the, because the guy had a lantern in there for light. We could actually see what the heck he was doing, see what he was doing. And, ma- and managed to managed to crawl down the coal pile, pile. And the only reason we knew she was there is my fireman when we got out of the tunnel. My fireman started shoveling and noticed her. Yeah. So how'd she kill herself? Um, basically what happened was she stood in the worst possible place as we came out of the tunnel. When my fireman reached over and grabbed his shovel, shovel, and he swung his shovel around, he basically knocked her right off. Oh. He knocked her off the side of the, off, through the, through the cab door. That is not protected in any way, shape, or form from you falling off. Oh damn! And here's oh, the thing. I haven't heard about this on the news. Be- because we covered it up. Oh. See, sometimes I think you lie, and I don't know why. But yeah, we get. Yeah. Here's the thing. We never mentioned the incident to anybody. Mm. The only three people that know of this incident is me, my fireman, and the head end brakeman who was in the doghouse. Because he heard everything. Uh, but... But what did the police do? Did they ever figure they out? They never... They don't know. They don't know about it. And you do realize that this is... You're, you're saying this and this is all on live, right? Correct. Correct. But here's the thing. Have I given... Have I given any names out? Well, no, but you can... Exactly. Oh, exactly. Can... Meaning, as far as anybody is concerned, I'm anonymous. Nobody knows who the hell I am. Well... Nobody knows who the hell my fireman or fireman, the victim, 
Because I never learned the victim's name or my or my head and brakeman. Are you? So as far as the media is concerned, nobody, nobody knows knows anything about you? it. So how is this real? How is this real? Because I saw it with my own eyes. Yeah. I was the I was the engineer, mind you. Yeah, but can you confirm <sighs> this? Can you show us a picture of you and the? Like sometimes I I thought I when I when I'm at night I think about your career and I think about is this really true or is this for entertainment? Like do you have a picture of your first day in the cab? Must have been a <laughs> kind of what kind of engine was it? Yeah, exactly, sir. I they can still like contact you through your Discord because they you can see the usernames and they have the. <clears throat> And then some people actually can contact you through your because of some people can actually get your tag. Mm -hmm. Because so you're not you're not realizing that people can actually still contact you because on live hey, that, you this is this is this incident happened three years ago. Yeah, but at least you're hey, nothing, this at is least this was pre COVID. This is pre COVID. Wait, wait, wait! Nothing. Don't say that! Don't say that! Don't say that! We don't want to get demonetized. This is uh, sorry. This, sorry. This is pre. This is pre the unforeseen consequences that was 2020. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Correction. Uh, Pack. I was about to about to edit edit what I just said out. The bad word out, if you can. Uh, he can't. He's live. Wait, dang this it. Is live. Wait, dang it. Anything about it? Yeah, dang it. Sorry. Yeah. So this is this was before. This was like I think it was. Summer of 2019. I forgot forgot what month it was. Man, yeah. but if I could stream, if I could stream, I would sh I would show you guys a video video of me in winter, me driving a steam engine, driving the engine in winter. Mm. I think you did show me a photo. Yeah, I think you did show me of you mm -hmm. volunteering at a railroad somewhere yeah. in mm -hmm. like the northern part of Texas. <laughs> um, uh, spirit, you, uh, spirit, you asked what what kind of engine was it? It's a um, Denver Rio Grande Western class K thirty six, specifically number four eighty nine. Show a picture of it. Show 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 a show, show a picture of the engine of the engine. Let me just go and just go find find one real quick since I don't I don't have a picture in, in my files of it. Um, I know this is, I know this is a black and white picture. Oh, sh oh shit, never mind. Never mind. Uh, never mind. Yeah, f f forget I said that that, forget I said that that's a shit picture. Anyways, um, so toxic people. Does anybody have a Karen story that they'd like to share? Like anybody, any encounters with a toxic person Seriously? they would like to share? Right. Raise your hand if you if you want to share okay, your story on. about a toxic person or any sort of encounter with a Karen. If you have any encounters with toxic, if you want to explain it, raise your hand. Pressing the raise your hand button. Uh yeah. Uh, so, so so sorry sorry if you guys can hear me. Hear me ruthlessly murdering my keyboard when I when I type something. I heard you say raise your hand through your microphone. Yeah. I guess nobody wants to explain their story. I don't think uh, anyone has a story, to be honest. Oh, uh, Big Bill, Big Bill Hills. Okay. Uh, yeah. All right. Well, I guess I can explain my car my character in class for them. Oh wait, no, we got one. Okay. Oh, so my question. Okay, so my question is, um, 
Is can it be? Is it strictly in real life, or can it be online as well? Um, uh, it, it can, can be, be online. It can be both. Okay. Okay. So. I have this one story about this one guy. He's he's running this Dave and Bambi server, and he's um <laughs> he's um, um he's inside, and he's he he's claiming to be thirteen, but he's actually eight, and he's doing a bunch of stuff. So what happens is later, uh, this uh, my homeboy over here gets exposed for stealing the main character of the mod from Twitter. Man gets hard exposed. He just goes off. He he, he just goes. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna fire all of you if you if you complain about this any further. I will fire all of you and cancel the mod. He will never get anyone. <laughs> <laughs> what the- what, what the actual- what the actual fucky fuck? Wait, he, is, he is screaming at everyone in the top of his voice, and he- and everything oh, by has- the way, um... Why are you so hilarious, uh, man? Uh, Spirit, I'm sending a better picture in the, um... I'm sending a better, better picture- picture of the- of- at least the type. Yeah. I couldn't get an um, p- exact picture of the actual engine involved. But that's ignore the spring switch and spring switch mm-hmm. stand and the uh, and the actual switch stand. Um, that's not a spring switch in the um, in the Nomad chat. By the way, um, they, mm-hmm. uh, yeah. try to avoid using all the stars because you know, Mac oh, yeah. Yeah, on YouTube back. is gonna be like, like demonetize, 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 copyright. Copyright, copyright, demonetize, demonetize, copyright, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, Ow. Copyright, copyright, copyright. So, anyways, again. <laughs> <laughs> I love the audio. Man. What? <laughs> that echoed. That e- you, you're saying that echoed through Pac's mic? <laughs> that we just made it funny. Yeah. Oh, by the way. Oh, by the way. Something that's interesting. It's 486, it doesn't have a doghouse on the back of his tender. Oh, wow. It doesn't have a doghouse on the back of his tender. You gotta be kidding. No. Spaghetti! No, Spaghetti! No. Spaghetti! Oh, she has lots of spaghetti! Oh. I actually stand corrected! Wait, 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 we forgot to put Big Hill. Big Bill, Big Bill Hill, Crescent, Big Bill Hell's back. Um, yes. oh, imagine saying that like five times fast. Yeah. Like, yeah. Be, like impossible. Yeah. What? No, but here's the thing. What's interesting yeah. is um, uh, one wait. of the Drago and Silverton um K36s have their dog houses on the backs of their tenders. Four seventy three. 476 and 478 all have their dog houses, and all of the Coopers and Tolta K36s and the 137 they have have all have the dog houses. Zara, you can only still go once. Remember that. Yeah, I think the um, I think the 493 has her dog house. Mm. I think I could be wrong. 493 has her dog house. All right, so um. I'm watching the stream right now. Yeah. Um, uh, try to fix your um stream. Try to get a better streaming service. Cause right now I'm hearing a lot of echoes that shouldn't be happening. Oh, that's strange. Yeah. It's it's like gathering a lot of whispering. Oh, it's probably because I'm playing the stream while I'm. Oh, I'm dumb. Yeah. Off. Yeah, yeah. Whoops. Sorry if you got your ears raped. Oh, sugar, I can't say that! No, 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 wait, yes, you know, actually, actually, yes, you can, in that, yes, you can, you can't actually say that in that context, you can't actually say that in that context, we almost got demonetized there for a second, almost, if you worded that, worded that differently, yeah, that's a demonetization, also, even though it's like a Sunday, um, Sunday, ne- um, it's, it's, Sunday a, it, it's a Friday. No, next, the, the, no, Sunday, mm-hmm. like the Sunday, September 11th, we're going to mm-hmm. do an extra podcast called, Where Were You on 9-11? Where was I on 9-11? Well, not yet, not yet. 
not yet, not until like save that story for for the upcoming Sundays. No, I'm done. Oh my god, sorry. Be right back. Oh yeah, I'm ten four. My mom was talking to my cat, sorry. Hi Odie, what are you doing? He's being bad boy. Oh, fair enough. Thanks. Odysseus, don't even think about it. No. Your cat? Being naughty boy today. This morning. Uh, this morning. I was off from school today. And that doesn't your mom always forget what days you have off? Like this morning I have off because Labor Day. And suddenly she comes. I'm on. I'm sleeping in the hallway in my sleeping bag. And she comes in and is like, okay, get up. Get up for school. And I'm like... <laughs> Oh, by the way, get this. Get this. You wanna know what's you, you wanna know what concerns me about the Dragon Silverton? Oh, sorry for the meowing noises. Those are packs cats. Oh fair enough, but yeah, but anyway. So they don't they haven't replaced their track. Like they're the full the forty the full forty fifty miles of track that they actually have laid down. Forty five miles main line, about five miles a yard track total. For 50 miles. They haven't replaced that track since 1980, 1981. Those tracks have been in service for 40 years. Mm. Wait, we're getting off topic. Let's get back on topic. Let's get, yeah, let's get back, yeah, let's get back on topic. The toxic people, which nobody really, this is kind of a bad choice for a first start. I never told you about my Karen experiences. Um, so let me tell you about one. Me and my friends were, were like, skipping rocks to see... We were doing, like, some sort of experiment outside. Going to see if rocks would also skip on land instead of water. Um, one went off and almost hit this lady's car. But it was, like, on still on the hill. Not even, like, like three feet away. Like, five feet away from her car. She gets out and she's like, I'm going to tell the manager that you were throwing rocks in my car. The and my manager. friend's like, what? Oh, wait, what's, what's the manager of I'm outside? I'm going to tell them... Huh? Who was the manager of outside? Oh, oh so I just saw it being so upset. No, I live in an apartment complex, so there's like this manager that monitors the area, so. <laughs> oh, yeah, fair enough. What's that yeah. laugh? So, and then uh, and a minute later, she goes into the office, and then we're actually, and we thought we were fricked up, but she was just dropping off We're doing like some sort of. So, so we were actually okay, but we ran behind one of the complexes, and so we never saw that lady again. Mm. Um, another encounterment I had, we were walking down from the college that I live right next to. I'm not going to explain it, because then you're going to find my location, and then you're going to track me down, and then you're going to rape me. But anyways, anyways, we're going to... Um, we're going to... We were in the college, we're in the football practice field doing some baseball. And we were doing some baseball, suddenly, and then we were leaving, yeah. I think. Actually, and then this guy, like there's this, like, really mean security like, guard that eats my friend. Rating there's, this, there's this one security guard that really hates my friends. It's not really a toxic, he's a real toxic person. He comes up in his little security truck, pulls right up and says, Hey guys, how are you? Like, we all know what he really does to people, so we just ignore him and walk away. He's like, excuse me, you think you ignore me? We just walk away and went home. I haven't seen him since. Um, although I can't explain my friend's encounterment stories with him. Um, uh, the, the jerk uh, that was across from my apartment into, um, his apartment, he was, um, riding his bike, actually. He wasn't doing anything wrong, and um, like he usually does, he was just riding around. And then this kid, the guy comes out and he's like, "Excuse me, you shouldn't be on this private property. This is private property." And he's like, "No, it's not private property." They were throwing the trash. Oh my god, There's mom! Jesus Christ, I'm live, mom! Oh, oh my god, I'm not on camera. Mom. Oh, that is so embarrassing. Today we're having some uh, a little bit of technical difficulties. So. <laughs> no, we're having a little bit of technical difficulties. Oh, let, let, uh, let me rephrase that. We're having, we're having a little bit of parental difficulties. Pat, can you just turn your screen down? Okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> that came through hard on my end. 
I came through hard on Discord. Yeah, but uh, yeah, um, Apple is having a little bit of quite hard um, print. Uh, let's just say that, let's just, I'm just gonna play, play things here and say parental issues. Okay, I'm back. Okay. Okay, no, okay cool. Yeah, he's back. Okay. He was just having some issues with his parents. He comes up and he's like, blah, 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 which in matter of fact reminds me of another Karen encounterment oh, story. Jesus and I'm like, okay, so that's basically the end yeah. of his story. He just rides around and goes home and now he's not allowed back in because that bitch and security guard's gonna come back. So, yeah. Anyways, my third story was when me and my friend were scootering down because all of our all of our other friends were gone and the jerk was gone too. They were just riding down in the private co in the um little college. It's not private property because my the oldest out of all of us, well, the second oldest, he actually knows some of the security guards and let us um and lets us like ride around sometimes. But apparently he didn't share with the other people that we we're, we're, we were allowed back there. Oh my god. God. Damn, he's not having much luck tonight, is he? Yeah, that's just my mom. She's talking on the phone with a friend and doesn't realize that I'm live, even though I told her like three times already. <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> anyway, somebody, just, somebody just said something down hard and it's hard in the background on someone's end. Basically, we were just scootering down. We're about to enter the college, and then suddenly there's this lady, random lady, talking with some people who work there, and she's like, excuse me? You shouldn't be here. Where are your mommies? We're like, bro, I'm sorry. This We we are allowed here? And she's like, no, you're not. This is private property. And he's like, where do you live? We don't, we didn't, we did tell her where we live, but we didn't tell her the exact apartments. So she said, well, you shouldn't be here. This is private property and nobody's allowed on here besides students and teachers. So I think you should leave before I call the cops on you. We're like, uh, we didn't want to deal with anything that day, so we just left. Well, and then we did sneak up, and then we did sneak up on her. We we didn't find her after that day, and I ne and we never saw her again. Okay, then. It's 9 o'clock, so we have about 30 minutes left. Um, Does anybody have a 30-minute story? If not, I'll just look at random Karen or toxic people encounterments and Reddit. Uh, what's this? Uh, I don't have anything to... I mean... Um... Does anyone have... Um, <laughs> you, uh, you, um, you asked if anyone had anything to talk about for the next 30 minutes or so. Uh, Zerg, you can only go up once. Postal, do you have anything? Got anything, Postal? Go up once each week, uh, each Friday. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. Oh no, Pat. Uh, let me ask anyone from my group DMs. Wait, ready? Yeah. Do you have anything? Yeah. You got anything? Nope. He does not have anything. Don't have anything. All right, cool. Uh, so what are we gonna talk about for the next half hour? Not sure. And we're, I'm gonna talk to Vio real quick and see if he has any stories. Oh, Vio. So, what? Um, I, I haven't talked to Vio in a long time. Yeah, he doesn't like you. Really? Yeah. Yeah, he doesn't like you. Why the hell not? I don't what, know. What happened? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I know what happened. I just told Vio. Um, I I I, th I think I know why Vio doesn't like me now. Yeah. I think Carol got to him. Got yeah. to him. Spread his. Spread his. I'm going to tread lightly. I'm going you to tread. I'm going to tread very lightly here. It's. I'm going to say, disease. Also, um, quick moment, you might hear- I have to play with my cat for a second, so you might hear some, like, meow, or sudden, okay. like, or these sounds where he bites the toys I'm playing him- I'm playing oh. with him, like, so- Oh, oh fair enough, okay, yeah, fair enough. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, so this is an official headphone warning for you guys- for all you guys that are wearing headphones, including me. Yeah, and the mic and pack streaming service is very bad, so- yeah, so this yeah. is an official headphone warning. 
So yeah. Uh, let's see. Does Vio have anything? Uh, I don't nope. think so. Nope, he doesn't nope. have anything. Uh, uh, okay. One of my friends and see if he has anything. Hmm. Then I or Luke. MC Hockey Train Lover. Train Lover definitely has somebody. Oh, Joe, what the hell happened to him? He he owns a bunch of railroads now, and he bet I bet his ass he probably encounters um. Uh, uh no, but um, <laughs> here's the thing. Remember Creeper? <clears throat> no. Right. If you've ever met him. What's his no. name? I think I know. Oh, fair enough. Um, he's from Houston, Texas. Wait, what's his? Oh, uh, you want his Discord? You, you want his Discord username pack? Oh, what's his like full name? I don't even know. He never told me. All I know is his Discord name. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. His full Discord name. All right. Um, I just. It should be um, if I can scroll down far enough to find it. It's ten P three sixteen. Well, oh, yeah, for I, you, from I think I actually know who that guy is. I think I know. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Train lover, he he didn't even reply back yet, so I have to wait until they reply back. Um, in the meantime, here's some here's some uh, ASMR for the next half hour. ASMR. ASMR. Obviously, I'm. I'm just gonna look at stories on Reddit. I'm just gonna look at stories on Reddit and see if they have anything good. Reddit. I like reading things from Reddit. Uh, uh, r r slash Karens, I guess. R slash Karen ends in the wild. Here we go. All right. Uh, let me see if I can find a paragraph story. Uh, eh, here's a good one. When I worked at a Walmart a few years ago, this was from Zombie Taco Party. Uh -huh. When I wa when I worked at Walmart a few years ago, a lady parked in the fire lane. The door greeters standing outside were in charge of telling them if they need to move. Of course, this was me at the time. Since she wasn't in her vehicle, I had to know notify one of the higher-ups that she was parked in the fire lane. So they called on the speakers and told her she, she needs to move. When she came out to move her car, she got in my face and yelled at me. She hopes I'm happy now. Oh, and called me a, a, a female dog and drove off. I never work at Wal I will never work at Walmart again, and I have respect for anyone who, who has and is. People suck sometimes. Bro. You don't work at Walmart anymore because of that. I'm sorry, but you don't walk, work at Walmart anymore because of only one encounterment. They probably... Damn. That's kind of weak, man. I would just keep walking. Yeah. Uh, uh, sorry, that's a text. Ah, uh, well, I guess... I oh, this one it will last us, like, 15 minutes, which is actually good. <clears throat> this don't one is by Frank... Frankincense. Frankincense. I am a security guard of a gated community. Because of guards that guards that have not been fired, who are giving me who hasn't even worked here a year since I early, we are checking we are we are not checking IDs. We are told specifically that gate doesn't open without an ID. I get a lot of weird uh, I got I get a lot of problem residents. My job is pretty cushy. Air conditioning in a desert state a mini fridge, and a personal bathroom. If my company hated me, they put me as a standing card until I got my act together. I'd stand outside in the hot sun with no, uh, no bathroom, um, no break room, and mini fridge. I'd have to keep my lunch and water on me. Paid lunch, we don't abandon toast. I st safe to say, I'll do whatever I want to keep my... Uh, I'll do whatever or I'm told to keep my favor a favorable position. Oh, hold on, hold on. My cat's toy is well, my my cat's toy is stuck, so I need to get it. Okay. Um, here we go. I'll do whatever I want to keep on my favorite position. 
This woman always going on about uh, how the other that other guy is it, let, that other guy j just lets her in. She comes in three times a day. After all, I let her know. Oh yes, I know. But point to the sign. Guests and residents must show their ID for entry. She says again. The other guy lets her in. I grin under my mask, knowing who she is talking about, and given permission to inform. She, he was fired for that exact reason. They have their, they have their IDs, mind you, because hooks them um, straight up and said they're grumbling. And, um, they're grumbling. They just don't want to go through the trouble of finding a wallet in their purse and taking the ID and taking the out the ID. This lady is crazy and. She is, oh my gosh, I'm calling your company for this. And I say, I say, of course, go right ahead. Still smiling. At this point, I'm just following rules that my superior gave me. He says, and she says, quote, quote, unquote, well, you need to calm down with, with that because that is ridiculous. <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry, dry throat. <clears> throat> Damn. You got um, I was go okay. Damn. I uh, I'll be right back for just a second. Let me just I'm let me just make sure I can actually talk properly first. Uh, we'll be right back after these messages. Back put on commercials. Back commercials. Commercial break. Uh, can we uh, commercial break for a second? While the rest of us get our acts together. Wait, I hold on. At 9.15 uh, EST or 8.15 CST, we'll be right back. When we are on commercial break, we have to be muted until the exact time we get back. Not really the best with these commercial breaks or whatever, so this is the best it will get. Pack, can you make me a channel moderator for a second? Alright, let's.
Welcome back to Friday Night Podcast. Tonight's topic, toxic people and how to find them. Welcome back to Friday Night Podcast. Tonight's topic, toxic people and how but to find them. But over the course of the past, what, 45 minutes? Welcome back to Friday Night Podcast. Uh, we have tonight's about 15 topic, minutes left, so I'm going to... But, oh, so for the, yeah, so for the past, yeah, and for the past hour and 15 minutes, it has been... A mixture of the topic for tonight, talks to people about how to find them, and just gen, just American, and just with a healthy dose, uh, correction, unhealthy dose of American railroading sprinkled in. Yeah. Because because we're all rail fans, and we uh, because most of us here are rail fans, and we can't help it. Actually, I'm an international rail faner because I caught a train in Puerto Rico recently. Say again. I'm an international rail faner because I caught a train in Puerto Rico just a few few weeks ago. You went to Puerto Rico. Yes, for the last week of summer. I'm going to say this, and if this video gets demonetized after this long, this long of swear, this long of us just swearing in general, I will be absolutely shocked. But yeah. you lucky bastard. <laughs> True. Anyways, back to our... Yeah, anyways, we got, four, we got 14 minutes left. What are we going to talk about for the next 14 minutes? The story. The story. Mm -hmm, that I was talking about. Okay, fair I enough. Say, of course. Still smiling. At this point, I'm just following rules that my superior gave me. And she says, well, you need to calm down because this is ridiculous. While she is, while well, the woman is, the passenger screams, F those rules, and shows me her ID since she is a resident. And I have to take down her info into a log, a violation log. Because residents shouldn't be using the guest gate, my gate, eight. They get fined after so many times passing through the guest gate. I doubt she'll get fined, but she won't. I didn't have to worry about worry if our guest who was driving would just show her ID. While driving off, they were yelling about how I shouldn't have, have, have to take anything down. She lives here. Why can't I just let pe people that live that live her in her? That's what it says. I think that's grammatically incorrect. Let me reread. Oh, that's it. I'm so sorry. We're having quick technical difficulties. Um, I'll be right back. All right then. Yep. All right then. We got. Food. We got like. 12 minutes left on this this podcast before it's over I'm right back <laughs> okay oh sorry about that <laughs> um uh, she lives here I, I just uh, let, let big bill as far as um as far as you asked the question what do you think is the worst railroad currently that is in the US that, for me, right now, would be CSX. Um, for me, it's Long Island Railroad. Why? Why? Why, why, why particularly Long Island Railroad? They've been having so many delays because of subway and track problems that I think it's just you shouldn't. I think you should just take a shuttle bus now. Yeah. I mean, but here's the thing. With CSX, they've had so many derailments that it's the likely that there's not that if you try to ship something, let's say, explosive, like military supplies, military supplies for a, for a, um, for a particular situation that's happening in Europe. Oh, uh, you mean RXU? <coughs> RXU, yeah. yeah. Uh, pretty much what's happening what's happening as far as RxU is concerned. Um yeah, what is happening with RxU? Um potentially potentially uh potentially half of Europe could get re irradiated. Because Chernobyl is a thing, apparently. Oh 
Oh uh, yeah, Chernobyl is still a thing, obviously. Uh, and no, but here's the thing. You know what's like, you know what's unnerving <laughs> about that? We have ten minutes left. I have one more paragraph, and then we can go off topic for, like, five minutes, and then back on topic for the rest. Yeah. All right, cool. They forget I work for the H... Actually, no, no. We're going to have the five minutes on topic, and then the rest of the five minutes off. They forgot I work for the HOA oh, board. They signed the HOA contract that says they they hire a guard. Yeah, they pay me to sit in the box until someone drives up so that I can Four check seven. IDs. All right. Yeah. All right. That one is a short story. Um, let me see if I can find any Discord drama that's going on that I will explain. Well, let's see. Rail bu- Uh, I really don't want to explain the railroad. Let me see if I can find any Discord drama. So. I don't think there's much, there much Discord drama. Alright. Uh, let me see if I'm there's any- like, uh, hang on. Uh, let's see. Shoot. Oh, shit, hang on. Mm. Uh, let me see if there's anything going on. Railfan, oh yeah, the Justin guy, that guy, yeah, I guess I can explain that. Toxic people. Justin? Hang on a minute, hang on. Toxic um, Justin. Can I like? Can I share a story for um, story from one of the servers that I'm in? Yeah, is it drama? Is it toxic? Um, is it toxic and? Yeah, uh, yeah, okay. pretty much. Is she? Yeah, is she somebody for being banned? Banned for no reason, reason because of toxic fucking um admin. Mhm. Oh, but I'll, I'll basically I'll basically read this out word for word exactly how this is going to happen. Base, um, I'm 17, I choose not to talk, basically select mute. Which means I only talk where I am comfortable and anywhere else. I be- anywhere else. Anywhere else, I basically am a mute. Specifically, I'm not comfortably verbally talking online, like Discord, or while gaming with voice tones. If there's an opportunity to type, I take it, or just don't talk at all. Well, I have uh-huh. recently been banned from two Discord servers and Twitch, Two Discord and Twitch servers because you got an argument uh, about my speech for posting this. Uh, mm-hmm. And quote, um, begin, yeah, uh, begin quote. Sorry, hope y'all don't mind. I gotta go on a rant, kind of. This isn't for, for for anyone in particular, but I hope you understand what I'm getting at. Um, end quote. Next line. Next person. Quote. Oh, we don't mind that you choose not to talk or select mute. We would love to have you play, end quote. Um, ellipsis. A large portion of the time is I play at least one of these five things happen. One, I get to- targeted for not talking slash. I've gotten killed for not answering a question between meetings. Um, I'm going to say he's, re- he's referencing Among Us here. This Two, is insane. News. We interrupt this program for instant mm-hmm. Applehead breaking news. Oh, Roblox has recently just changed their logo, and Roblox is getting hacked again. They are trying to block the hackers, and they are attempting and to regain control. However, this is just spread it as a rumor. We are not sure if this has been confirmed yet. We are looking into further evidence. More evidence will be found tomorrow in the Applehead news channel at tomorrow. Thank you for understanding. We go back to our regular programming. But the logo okay. change is true, though. That's for sure. The logo change is logo change is confirmed to be true. Um, let me get back to what I was reading. Number two, I get ignored the entire time. Someone's even when I call meetings or find a body. Okay, he's definitely recommending a, a referencing Among Us here. Among Us here for that one. I get told to talk one way or another, where it's me asking people to read chat, or I say I think I'm getting targeted. Four, mm. four. Okay, this is confirmed among confirmed. He's talking about um, uh, among us, uh, among us here. I get bit. I basically I get sussed out. Don't get a defense like everyone else because of type. Everyone else is too loud or yelling. Yelling. Basically, he's being targeted for not speaking. Five, quote, 
the this lobby is a mic lobby, mic only lobby. I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. End quote. Just because I type doesn't mean I don't have something to say. Being broken in at the start and then not, not even five minutes in, I already feel like I'm not wanted here. You sure you don't mind if I'm there? You're just gonna ignore, ignore that I'm there. <laughs> Up this program with more breaking news. Roblox and Roblox almost accidentally deleted their history, but we are not sure if this has been confirmed really. There are also some other news. Roblox is turning 16 years old. Mm-hmm. We are also been we are also trying to uncover the new developer update on the marketplace. The missing Roblox YouTuber also came back. Press we are not sure who this is, but we think that it is Preston Plays. We have not seen him for a while, so... Yeah. However, we are still trying to confirm that Roblox being taken over. We are not sure if this being confirmed yet. We now mm -hmm. go back to regular bro programming. Uh, right, go, yeah, go back to also, regular programming. Get back to where I was at, because... Also, uh, Preston Plays has been uploading for, like, forever now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, true, yes. Yeah. One of the two servers I posted this in, I was banned before, but one of them five minutes after posting, without even getting a warning, he was banned, like, instant. Huh. When I messaged that's why, they said it's because, quote, 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 being mean and hurtful without even, mean and hurtful, end quote, without even saying names, in which I very much could have. She was mad at, mad at him, but I had no remorse for the people that actually started the shit. Tend for it to be mean or hurtful in any way, which was just constantly happening. I was like, man, they blocked me. Basically blocked him. Oof. We have just discovered that Roblox being taken over is confirmed. There are now new scammers that are using the Roblox ad system to automatically give them and scam people to get Robux, hacking their passwords. Please do not o open any current Roblox Ox advertisements until this issue is being fixed. You might see ads that says giving away free Robux or taking over Roblox with these ads. Do not click them. They are instant scams. Roblox is at threat right now. Level 3. We now come back to our regular programming. More updates will be released tomorrow morning. Okay, so... At, so while this situation regarding um, Roblox is being sorted out, us here, us here at the Appalachian News Network have recommended that you do not play any Roblox games that are of suspicion. Suspicion until we, we have cleared, we or we or Roblox themselves have cleared uh, cleared have cleared the issues so avoid any Roblox game that is suspicious that pops up out of nowhere it could be a potential scam now what now what are we going okay what are we going to talk about for the next 2 minutes E. Chillicothe sub ain't sus, right? No. Um. Because uh, apparently Zerg is playing. As far as I'm, as far as I know, no, it's not sus. No, I mean any new games, any new games that suddenly become stupidly popular. Popular. That's. Yeah, so any new games that that instantly become stupidly popular, um, just avoid them like the plague until Roblox can either takes it down because it takes it down because it's one of the hackers games, or has cleared it and says you're fine, says it's fine. More breaking news. Oh, this is an automatic message that was just imported in by the Applehead news system. We have just discovered that it, if they find your ad, they could potentially hack it and send it 
it so that uh, when they play, so that they can change the link to their game so that they can scam you off. Do not click any advertisements at all. It is We are at potential level threat five. Code oh, red. Code not, red. Any point, do not click any links that you have been invited to. Do not click any advertisements until this issue is fixed. I repeat. Shit, 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 shit. So, sound the alarm. Thanks. That you are friends. Spirit, change your password. Spirit, change your password right now. Go change your fucking Roblox password right now. Yeah, do we it. Now return, we now return to the end of the podcast. Thank you for listening to Friday Night Podcast. Toxic people and how to find them. Railroad, rail, railroads, the railroads talk has been canceled and been replaced with the updates of the upcoming Roblox hacks. I, but once again, I repeat, do not click any links or advertisements that your friend or Roblox has sent you. No matter if, how legitimate it looks, do not click any of them. Correct. Thank do you. not click any advertisements under any circumstances. There is, a, there is the insanely high likelihood that it is connected to these scammers. Once again, Roblox is at potential threat level five, code red. Code red. Code red. There is one level, one level above code red. Code flashing red. Code, code flash red. red has not been confirmed yet. We will update you on the situation. We are, if, we are if, if code flashing red does occur, we will let you, let you guys know. Um, okay, so I'm getting more information. Mm -hmm. we, we, I'm going to continue to stream until 945. We're going to talk about the updates of this upcoming incident. Mm -hmm. We are not sure how bad it's going to get, but we, no. um, Postal, I, I need you to DM Aussie right now about the upcoming events. I need you to, um, I need you to, um, also let, uh, Spread the basically, basically spread the news. Um, we just got word that this is happening, like literally right now. Correct. It literally is happening right now, so it's gotten really bad. Check it is. It, ha it is happening right now. Yeah. So, um. Okay. So, um. Um. We're gonna actually keep you. It is excellent. Please stay. In can you get? Can you get? Do can you get completely you destroyed? You do play. Can you get destroyed on Xbox if you can click on the ads? Click on ad if you can select an ad and click on and I say click. If you can select an ad and interact with an ad, you are at risk. Roblox headquarters, New York in New York and Los Angeles has been reported. We are now looking at the progress chart. Mm -hmm. It has just went up. It has just went up just now at 8.48 p.m. At 2 p.m. earlier this at, at It says here at, it says here, 11.18 a.m. Reports have gone up by, reports have gone up by at least 65% and the baseline is 16. Mm -hmm. Reports or it's gone up by 65%. So please, like, please, please be cautious. We, August, we, we August 28th. August 28th. 28th. Today. No, August 28th. 2022 at 8.40 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. Daylight Time. The Avatar... Disruption was happening. I am I am not sure where he is getting the getting this new information from because I'm not I cannot corroborate anything with this at all. All right. So basically, I've just I'm not uh -huh. getting any update, but. I am refreshing the page right now, and we'll see what the reactions are now. Yeah. They've gone up. They've gone up. They, oh, wait. It 
just gone down a little bit, but oh, it went back up. It went back up. Um, are we looking? Are we looking at a? Are we looking at threat level? Are we looking at an imminent threat level six? Currently at 9:04 p.m. Baseline is 49. Reports have gone down at least by. Um, well, it's 40 percent now, <laughs> but it was 65 and uh, about a few hours ago. So. So currently there are no problem so currently there is still a problem with Roblox. Um please um screenshot any ads that you see that is likely a scam. Okay. We will set we will some people will set up all accounts to test them. Please, they can track other accounts that has the same password. So do not use the exact same password or on your as your main if you are testing and creating an alt account to see if these scams actually work. Please do not use your real password. Because they will be able to track that. Track down your main account and grab that one too. It's happened to me before in 2018. Mm -hmm. So... Yeah, the fiasco yeah, yeah, in 2018. Do not click anything. No matter how legitimate it looks... Do not click it. We 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 will have further in information up upcoming after this commercial break. Cut to cut to commercial. Sure, cut to commercial. All right, we will be right back. Also, I need everyone in, in the podcast to be searching up Roblox outages. I need everybody to um be muted at the same time while tracking down these.
Ladies and gentlemen, we are now back from right commercial now, break. Right now, the only data that I have right now It just is went down by 10%. It only went down by 4%. The, uh, the hotspots that I can detect right now are currently happening in New York, Dallas, Phoenix, LA, and San Francisco, all, all of which are North America. I can hear that. I can hear that too. There's also a slight, um, in Toronto, slight jump in Toronto. Yeah, I, but I it's not as bad as the other ones. I just literally got one. Pack, you need to remove the. You'll be right back. Thing, it's still there. Oh, I didn't realize. Huh. Yeah. Okay, I'm looking through. I'm looking through. I already found two. Um, let me see if I can find another one. So I got, got the white variant. I got another one. I just got another one. You just I got found another. All my Robux for this app. I just got another one. I can't believe it. You looking at that? Looking for those ads? I just got another. One. Found another. I literally one. just got another one. Yup, I'm filling up my storage on these pictures, though, so I'm just gonna delete okay. the pictures. Those are the only two I'm actually gonna take a shot of. Those are the ones that you shouldn't click. Also, breaking news, um, on Season 25, Skiff the Sailboat for Thomas and Friends has been confirmed to appear in Season 25, Episode 52, Skiff Sails Sodor. So that so, has been confirmed. So, so they're actually going to break him back. After the for the reboot, mm -hmm. which I you will you never see you will never see me watch the reboot. You will never you see me watch the reboot. I actually, it's act. You can actually watch the episodes that hasn't even been released yet on Cartoon Network app. What? Which you will never see me watch the reboot. I I'm most of the Thomas that I watch is. The classic series? All I'm getting is Squid the, Game. The classic series, the model series, and games. some of the G of the, of the CGI series. Um, I'm only getting like the um World Defender, Shop Plague, Athlete, Squid Game, and some sort of animal level up thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, I just got a new one. Yep, yep, there's another Robux one. Yep. Uh, you fight. Yeah, uh, there's another. There's another scam. There's another one. Um, someone found the group. Hey, the someone... stream. We're actually gonna delay the stream up till ten o'clock tonight, so mm -hmm. that we can actually get focused on the situation. Yeah, which yep, I will. Yep, another one. Which yep. I will pro probably have to drop out. To. Yep, I actually just got another one. I got the green one. They are liars, we are. Imagine getting outbid by Pooh Tycoon owners. Yep, there's another one. There's another one. Yeah. They're all... They're all there. Um, thanks to Blue Spirit Wind for um, showing us what the group is. Try to report the group. Take, take yep. you over Robux with that, bull. Uh... I got the same one at the same time, but that's real common. I'm I'm just gonna keep refreshing on my homepage until I get another fake Robux ad. I just got one with like, both. Uh, uh, I think I refreshed too much that I actually broke the Roblox, so I need to go into a new web page. Sees. Sees. I did. Do I did an oopsie. <laughs> I did an oopsie! Oh no, it's not loading! I did a big oopsie for a second. <clears throat> uh, I hate the new Roblox logo. Uh, <laughs> yep. Okay, there we go, it's loaded. Okay. Uh, yep, there, I think, actually, no, no, these are, uh-oh. Okay, there we go. 
They managed it. Yep, Ro not taking over, Roblox is just saying hi. Not taking over, Roblox just saying hi. Okay. Oh, Blue Spirit Line wants to speak. Can you put him up for me, big one, while I scroll through? Yep, I got another one for, I spent all Robux for this ad. Okay, right, go. Right, uh, All right, all right. Uh, spared you up. All right, You're so, up. um, go. uh, I found the group of it. Uh-huh. They have a Discord. Mm. Ooh. Oh, yep, I found another one. Show me you the Discord. Show yeah. Me the Discord. Show me, yeah, show us the Discord. Pack, right, pin, right. pin, pin, pin the link in the chat. Pin, pin the link in the chat. Oh, okay. I'm not there. All right, here's the Discord link. Send it in Please. the chat. I'm pinning the Discord. Send it. 128,682 members. Yeah, I know. Those are probably bot accounts. Damn, I'm getting a lot of pings here. What the frick was that? Uh, I don't wanna. You, no. Try to avoid that. Okay. What the frick was that high pitched noise? The scream you made. Yeah. That's yeah, same. Okay, so there, there's a, um, now they're scamming people on please donate, so. Well, they're not really scamming people, but they're making people take. But they're taking over Robux for no goddamn reason. Yeah. Boredom moment. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, put him back up. Put him back up for speaking. Put him back up. Put okay. it back up for speaking, run to that. Alright, um, I'm gonna hop in plus donate and then see what they're doing in there. Friday Night Podcast, Mark Roblox now, that's what I just said. What the hell are they doing? There's some, uh, by, by, by the way, Pack, Pack, there's some demonetization worthy shit in here, so I want to be careful about that. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes, so be careful about it. There are also GIFs that include, um, uh, H-E-N-T-I-A-N, so be careful of that. Yeah, basically, yeah, yeah, uh, basically, and I'm going to tread lightly here. Basically, what they're doing is they're basically trying to spread um, adult happy fun times around. Yes. No blip and also no hammer. Okay, so apparently they're all in the VC explaining how they're um, going and um, they're doing this stuff and how they how they think it's a good idea to freaking raid Roblox or Roblox. <laughs> Wait, y'all are in the in the. Why is on the VC? The car. The cat driving the car. Yes, that's actually. What? The, what the actual what? Cat drive. Why is it that? Because rich people don't respond to beggars. Yes. That cat finna just. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? This chat is moving way the hell too fast. 
I'm ba I'm bypassing the roll. I'm, I'm bypassing the Discord chat filter. What do you mean? I can't, so it's there were some sort of like sea sucker. Yeah. Or either asshole and coop. What the fuck is this shit? <laughs> I'm I didn't even like I. Yo, yo. That's, that's that's not demonetization. That's not de that 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 GIF isn't demonetization at all, is it? <laughs> if you can see that, if you can see that, Theo. <laughs> Just, just a little, just a little bit of, just a little bit of s slight pornography. There, no big deal. That's Bolsusa saxophone. That's saxophone. Bol -susa sax. What? What saxophone? I don't know. Hey Theo, Theo, you, you're seeing Theo, you're seeing this, seeing this boy, you're seeing this BS, right? I'm in looking the chat? at the in their I'm looking, chat. I'm looking at the uh uh thing on my phone, not on my <laughs> computer. I'm streaming on my computer. Okay, yeah. good. Your mother will explode in 47 hours, 38 minutes, and 12 seconds. <laughs> the cat gonna explode the mom. The mama. <laughs> Girls are dog toys. I know, right? Oh. Why do people want animals? Zerg the had that. Uh, like, huh? Anime. Not exist. Anime if you doesn't have exist. Anime sim, please call the hotline 1 800 balls 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 555. Five, five. <laughs> 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 oh god. <laughs> Damn. Balls balls balls. How about way to start violence? Oh, what the fuck? Day 6 of trying to get 7k to promote my game. <laughs> Azim is nuking three people. What? 24. 48. He also, like, like, one guy, one guy also consider this. What? One, one guy also considers this to be a dead chat. Look at how much shit's been said in the past three minutes. This is not a dead chat. Wow. Ow. My bad. Thanks, th thanks for blowing out my eardrums. <laughs> that hurt. Can I, uh, can, can I be, ex can I be excused for the rest of the, um, for the rest, rest of this and more than likely for tomorrow because it's 9 o'clock p.m. and I've been up all night and all day? Yeah, sure, you can go. Alright, cool. Cool. Yeah, I'll, 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 sign, I'll sign off real quick off the news network and, um, go to bed. I'll, I'll, I'll talk to you guys in the morning, I guess. All right. See you guys. <clears throat> okay, so big one is gone now. No, so it's just us and spirit. Yeah. I'm gonna get my charger real quick.
I'm mean, is done R has been done back. I'm so bored now. tonight's podcast we we do apologize for the longer times this wasn't expected because i didn't think this was uh i didn't think that it would get this bad so um yeah all right thanks for listening um i need all right heck you can end the stream and uh everyone please leave the um podcast see you next friday and sunday all right All right, thank you guys so much for watching this podcast here. Hopefully you enjoyed it. We're sorry about the extended time here. But uh, I'll be streaming next week. So I'll be seeing you then.